Welcome to the Grok Shop. In today's video, I'm gonna talk about when good apps go bad. So one of the cornerstone apps you need for any device is a file management app. And file management apps let you manipulate files on your device, uh, move them around, delete them, look at them. Uh, in addition to that, you may want an easy way to transfer files around on your computer network. Uh, on and off the device and so file managers are really good for this um, and one of the most popular is ES file Explorer it's been a staple for many years unfortunately the developers of the app decided to modify the app to include some intrusive um, add money-making components that happens but so how does this happen it happens because uh, uh, app automatic update is turned on by default. Most people don't know your apps are automatically updating themselves. Um, so we're going to show how to turn that off. But first, let's take a look at what ES File Explorer has done to become so annoying. So here's my phone with ES File Explorer uh, installed. You can see I plug in the charger here at the bottom. The little um, wave pops out showing that it's charging. And then what happens? Um, I get a blank screen and then I get this ES Smart Lock screen that comes on. Um, it's got a bunch of flim flam information that I don't really need. Also, it's an additional swipe to unlock the phone. And on top of all that, it's a service running in the background, draining precious resources. So given all that, there's really only one option. Uh, we will remove the app and find something better. And just as a double check, I'll plug the phone back in, make sure that uh, no unwarranted software lock screens come up again. Now to prevent relapses, I'll go to the Play Store app. I tap on the three bars in the top left up there and go down to settings, little gear, tap that. And at the very top, tap auto update apps. And in there, you want to tick do not auto update apps. And that's that. So what about free uh, file manager alternatives to ES File Explorer? I tried a few different ones. I like this x Explorer. Um, this has a drag and drop interface or a copy and paste. And you can see here my network on this side. And then you hit the little arrow, the blue arrow, and you can go to the other side, which will be my phone. And uh, if you turn the phone sideways in landscape mode, uh, you can see both sides at the same time. But in portrait mode, for the purposes of this video, use the little arrow. Um, here you can see I'm going to um, copy some files. You can, you can copy and paste to the clipboard and then paste over to the other side. Um, works pretty good and I'll just open this file up, make sure it came through okay onto my network. And there she is, she's looking good. That's how it's done guys. Thanks a lot for watching. Now if you wanna be the best, you got the moving mode